Hey yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Impendable, and we're back with uh Imp Tech over here. Um this is the impossible mode challenge for Software Inc., where we basically don't know what we're doing and we're trying to do the new impossible mode. Uh, because at the end of the last or sorry, about halfway through the last episode, um Imp Technologies unfortunately went bankrupt. And that sucks. But that's okay because uh, I learned a lot, and uh, I also learned I am terrible at post-recording production, like uh, doing post-commentary, I should say, and I have no clue what I'm doing. So what I did instead was, uh, why, is it, why are his eyes like that? Sir. Sir. Hold on. Eyes. Color. Color. Positioning is fun. What? Can't change the color? Um, anyway, what was I saying? Oh, I did learn a lot uh, from the time I was gone. I know the uploads are late here. I was sick over the weekend and uh, did not have time to record. Um, but I did have some footage of me trying a few different strats and they all ended terribly. I kept I, for some reason, I thought the antivirus was the way to go, and I kept trying to get it to work, and it just would not work. Um, so I learned a couple of things. I um, actually looked up some stuff, so it's not fully blind anymore, um, except after, like, the first initial start here, um, besides what I did, you know, last time. So um, the new impossible mode means there are, if I can see here, we have $100,000, uh, we cannot take contracts, deals, loans, and we cannot use a publisher, uh, which is crazy. And we only have one month before we go bankrupt, which I learned the absolute hard way. Um, <coughs> gotta cut that out. Um, but what I did learn is that uh, Capacitor... And Super Focus are insanely good. So we do not want ever want our people multitasking. We want them hyper-focused on one thing. Um, and then we can just take one bad thing since we don't... Like if we took um, two green, and we have to take two red. But I think it, this way we only have to take one blue, one green, and one red. So that saves us a little bit. Also, we can look down here. I put two stars into support. Uh, three stars into HR and one star into automation. And this is where the bread and butter is. System and audio are both two star. We have nothing in hardware and audio, which I think is the best way to go because nothing we're going to be doing is going to involve these two and uh, the artist as well. Um, speaking of, artist and lead are pretty as low as they can go. Um, service a little bit and design is the max, whereas programmer is not quite as max because... Obviously, it's just going to be us at the beginning because I'm I'm not going to add a founder because they eat into a lot of money uh, if we make it far enough for that to matter. Uh, hopefully, we won't. Or hopefully, we will. Sorry. Um, so, impossible. Everything is still good. And Inspiring Creativity, you see, we're focused on operating systems this time because that is where the money is at. So, we're going to go to pick a map. Uh, another thing I learned is these all have a rent cost per month which is terrible so what you actually want to do on impossible is start your own um start your own so you can see uh each area has a cost they all cost fifty thousand, no matter where you go um but the talent pool and the plot cost are different the added tax is where it's terrible. And of course, internet prov provider cost, um, utilities cost, background noise, beauty, whatever. That doesn't really matter. Uh, we want to leave it temperate for sure. Uh, rural has, you know, high internet provider cost, but no added taxes, but unfortunately low pools and plots. So what we, we want to start here, I think, just because of the no added tax with our low money. The city might be better because of the high talent pool. Uh, the 25% extra tax is not amazing, but the utilities are much lower. 
Um, which could be good. Uh, you know what? Let's try to start in the city. We'll, we'll try a city start. And I watched a little bit of videos and like tried to figure out sort of the best start. And really, it's start small. Start extremely tiny. I'm talking... Excuse me? That was weird. Why, where's the grid? Oh, we have to build... Oh, I plotted... I see. I was like, where is the grid? Let's just start over here. I was so confused. Um, yeah, this, this is the normal grid size. Okay. Uh, wall. We want to build a two... Two by four. Why why is the grid like this? Yeah. Okay, and then we want another wall here. There we go. We want this little piece. So it's gonna get a little ridiculous. Let's go ahead and add a window. <laughs> this is silly. I'm so sorry. Um, but this was the best strat that I saw. Um, I did look, there's a guy named CF, uh, who made a video a couple of weeks ago to help with the impossible start, because especially for a beginner like me, it is literally impossible. So we did our blind challenge and now we are doing, um, just the impossible mode challenge. Uh, still mostly blind, still not really sure what we're doing. And this isn't going to get us through, you know, everything, but it may help. Um, so Give him a little yoga ball. Give him a little plant. Where is our computer? There we go. Computer. There we go. Get a computer. We want this for design. Um, put a light in here so that they can see. There's fine. Oops. We got to go back to our construction door. Here. Okay. Here. Back to furnishing. Um, so we want this tiny little... I know, this is absolutely terrible. There's no ventilation. So we have to put in our own ventilation. We want to put a... An, excuse me, electric radiator. And we want to put an air conditioner. But we want the specific one. Where is it? Well, we do need a clock either way. Hello. I don't want the roof AC. Oh, just the AC unit. Okay, I was being silly. Um, and then we need an espresso machine because that seems to help with... Um, I know where I know where things are. We need an espresso machine because that seems to help with their ability to keep going even longer, even with the capacitor and everything. And then we want a bookshelf, of course. Always got to have a bookshelf. Put it right here as close as we can. And one other thing that I thought was really strange for the start is that you want you want a server as soon as possible. Um, So, it costs us $7 a month per MBS, which is 50 which is fine. But I'm not sure exactly what they even do to help us. You know, it's source control. Um, I, I just, I don't know. But apparently it is pretty important. Also, it's supposed to overheat in here, and that's apparently fine. It's way cheaper to, excuse me, repair it than it is to do anything else. Um, our room is a little too big, apparently. That's okay. I think we needed the extra space for this. Um, in his tutorial, he put down carpet and stuff. I don't think we need that. Carpet is for the weak. Uh, but what we can do is customize the room so that we can have uh, our own wheat office. Yeah. 
nice gold floor. There we go. Now we've got our colors. Um, I guess we could change this and then edit the colors. Uh, this is exterior, interior. Yeah, nice blood red. And then the floor, of course, will be our nice gold color. There we go. Kind of looks brown. That's okay. And we'll save that style as imp offices. There we go. Um, and this should be the start. So apparently what we want to do is manage our team. We want to work 8 to 12. And our founder should show up any second. <clears throat> okay. Not sure where he is. Sir. Oh, there he is. Well, uh, I guess, I guess I put this way on the wrong side of the thing, huh? My bad. And we don't want him wasting time. We want to develop, um, of course, imp OS. As soon as possible. Oops. And we want to skip to advance for future projects. We always wanted advanced. And if we analyze the market, you can see that security and customization are always the lowest. Um, so we want uh, file encryption. Uh, security, simplicity, security, customization, um, customization, well, we took two star for a reason, so let's use the two star, cool, and I think, I think that's pretty good. And we want to go ahead and develop it, even though our team is small, so that he starts working. Another thing that a lot of people uh, have suggested in, like, the forums and, and especially on the tutorial and everything were to go to all companies and sort by founded. And we can see we have one founded two years ago, which is not perfect. But it's also not terrible. So if we look at their details, we can buy all of their stocks for 299000 We can buy... Um, how much are they worth each? We basically want to buy all of their stocks. So 44 shares. I don't know if this is ideal since they're not a new company. But we're going to buy it. And hopefully it should go up, and we basically keep our bills below cost with that. Um, so basically, from this point on, we just run until we have some iterations going. And then... Yeah, and it is going to take a while. Oh, we also want to uh, sign our release date to... Apparently, this is the most optimal release date. So, we now just run at high speeds, let our founder do his work for an unholy amount of time. 8 to 12, that's like a 16-hour shift. Which is fine with us. I mean, as long as we're not the ones really doing it, you know? And, of course, the late in the day, he starts to slow down, but... I mean, he's getting so much work done. Look at that. Already, like, 10% in one day. Okay, and then this company has started selling more shares. We also want to keep all companies open, maybe, so that we can see if anything new opens. Oh, look at this. A new company just opened. We actually would like to, to watch for them. Let's see. Your name is Prime Tone. Prime Tone? Toen? Let's see. Prime Toen. 
Do they have anything coming up? Uh, from, oh, nope, that's not them. From Towen. Oh gosh, I do not see them. We will keep an eye on them for now. OS. Yeah, we, we they don't have a product released yet. So we're going to keep an eye on them. Uh, let's see. Every month. We'll remember to pull that up. Um, yep, and a company hasn't started selling more shares. We obviously cannot buy all of their shares. Let's see. How many can we buy? One share? Let's see. One share. Oh. One. Can I, can I buy... Two shares. Two shares is fourteen hundred. Take, take it. Okay. And then skip. And we also want to keep an eye. They are not publicly listed. Keep them up here. Keep an eye on this and keep its state pretty high. Preferably above like seventy five percent or so would be best. Um. And we'll just keep on working. Oh, look at that. Um, we actually made some profits from dividends. So $208. Um, and I think dividends, not that I'm like a stock whiz or anything, but I think dividends are basically the excess we make from our uh, stocks. Just, just owning them. Let's see. So... We made uh, 1300 and I don't believe we can buy much more, but we made a lot of money from them because they're new. So let's just keep buying their stocks. And keep it kind of lowered and out of the way here. And keep on trucking. And now we are up to $47,000 just from these guys. So I think we're done probably buying here um, because it's just so expensive. We want to keep buying these shares. Um, so we want to buy as much as we can, uh, which is eight shares. Okay. Working away. Is that a new animation for when you're super happy, by the way? Seems like it. Yeah, I think we maybe just abandon ship down here. We lose 9.3% and just invest all our money into these. $1,600. We're up 207%. We've already made $144,000 on these stocks. And we keep getting even more. Um, any new companies out? Nope, oh, not yet. So stocks are actually the way to go to make money, uh, it turns out. You could pretty much make anything. And not not assigning the server is crazy to me. Why did I do that? It, ha it won't let me assign it anywhere else. It's so annoying. Already on iteration two now. Bumping our way up through it. And now, uh, we have a pip. And we want to educate. Oh, sorry. Educate. And we definitely need the three star here. We can't afford it because it costs 5000 So what we're going to do, of course, is use our money wisely. Um, 
details. Yep. And we're going to sell just so we have 5,000. We can sell a share. That was just a share, right? Okay. Yeah. 99. They just bought a lot of shares all at once, I guess. Um, and we want to educate and we want this speed boost here for system, which will be nice. He will be gone a month, but I think in the long run it's worth it. And let's check our companies if anything's going on. Nope, still, still Prime Loan is the best. Prime, Prime Tone, whatever the hell their name is. Okay, and I believe, yeah, we are on the next day, or on the next month, I should say. Um... Can we buy them just back from these guys? I wonder if I keep buying them from private investors. So I can buy... Four shares from private investors, or... I guess they're worth exactly the same amount. I guess we buy from the private investors. I don't know which one's better. Um, I mean, we're making an awful lot of money from it, so that's pretty cool. Um, so even if this strat doesn't work out quite the way I was hoping because of that, uh, we can start a new run easily and then work on anything we want. Like, it doesn't have to be an operating system. I don't have to follow that tutorial exactly. Now that I know how the stocks work, that's, that's the game changer. So you can't use loans or contracts, but stocks are still a thing. And if you're really lucky on your start uh, to get a company that starts, you know, pretty early, not anything before, you know, maybe 1978 or 77 uh, would probably cost way too much to even try. You'd probably have to just restart until you get something um, like 78 because that, that really started, kickstarted us to be able to buy stocks into this brand new one that started. And look how much they're worth already, $42 million, um, which is crazy. So, you know, it could, it could screw us over, which is fine. Um, uh, we'll have to see. So if we look at our employee, if we look at impendable now, oh, he's at a three-star system. Did, was he not gone for a month or did it skip the whole month? I actually wasn't paying too much of attention there. So now we know the strat for future runs. I think that was the big, the big thing, like... It doesn't necessarily have to follow this this video that I found or, or these strats that I found besides the stocks. Because um, if you can work the stock market, you can kind of do whatever you want. Uh, you can make enough money to survive, basically. And we've invested. We have $435,000 in stocks. <clears throat> Honestly, I'm not sure if it would be in our best interest to actually liquidate either you know what i mean because if these guys ever went bankrupt we would be in trouble like what um products do they own oh they have they're actually our competitor they actually have an operating system as well they have sloth okay interesting specialization computer operating system i actually didn't read that that's really funny uh so we're actually doing the best thing and buying out our competitor right now um we are slowly not making as much Uh, from our shares is I wonder if it's because it's divided so much like they have 200 shares now I wonder if we just start buying shares from them one share I don't know that's why does that not work one that's so weird Please. Am I doing something wrong? One. Enter. Enter does not work. One. Spacebar. What if we did ten? No? I don't I don't know how to get just one. Please. Can I get just one on this? Yeah. Okay. Guess we'll be buying from them for a while. 
And I'm one yeah, again, I'm wondering if our profits are, or our dividends are going down. If we pull up our monthly profit here. Uh so yeah, dividends four thousand this month, but three hundred, eight thousand this month. Um yeah, I'm not exactly sure how it's working, but at least we're still still getting a little bit of money from it. Uh oh. Ah, oh, figure out how it works. It's actually asking for money, not for how many stocks I want to buy. Okay, that makes sense, I guess. Uh oh. All right, so we are gonna go bankrupt in twenty-four hours, but we have so much available in stocks. It's obviously the best. I think we just liquidate some of our assets, even though our competitor will um be getting a bunch of it as well. We're just fine. Um. Oh, yeah. We wanna. Well, we've got it pulled up over here. Uh, so we're just going to go ahead and sell, I don't know, let's say 10 shares, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. We lost a bunch of money this month, 15,000 on maintenance. What were, what in the fuck was our maintenance? Oh, maybe because we let it go too low. Go ahead and just hire a round of these guys. There we go. As long as we're in the green at the end of the timer, I believe we should be okay. But yeah, Super Focus is really helping us out. I think my biggest drawback is the server. I'm not exactly sure what they do. Actually, I'll tell you what. We're going to take just a second here. And we're going to say team coding. When your team is creating a project, you need a server to keep the code and help keep quality and speed up. The bigger the team of project. Okay. Um, I see. So, so it is actually, it does actually make the code faster. Uh, it also seems to be obviously for networking games and multiplayer games, but we won't have to worry about that for quite a while. So in four hours, we're going to make sure we're hopefully going to see that we're fine. Um, I am a little scared <laughs> about the timer. Okay, we're good. And just make sure... I'm actually just going to hire IT next time instead of the maintenance and see if that fixes it. Uh, so we can see our dividends, $4,000. And we will go... Let's open up company, see if a new company came out. Nope. Still, same old, same old. Let's see how many of theirs we can buy. Get 19,000. Let's keep a little in the bank now. We'll slowly start buying shares from Shark Lloyd Digital. Speaking of, who are they? Shark Lloyd Digital. These guys. They're worth $156 million. Oh, I'm sorry. They're worth $242 million. That's how much they have in the bank currently. 4 million fans. What do you got? What are your products? Oh, okay. You you guys are monsters of this industry. Bunch of games. A couple of 2D editors. An OS. An OS. Okay, how much is one of your shares worth? I can't even see. Um, yeah, they're worth a lot. <laughs> Onwards and forwards. Okay, I guess he got some espresso to go, go, go. Is affected by the heat? I don't know. I mean, just repairing it seems okay. Calling IT and seems like it's okay. Okay, so we are in iteration three finally. We're kind of on schedule. June 1981 is good. <clears throat> uh, we do have more education. Uh, and we saved enough money to do so. So we obviously want the three star in 2D as well. And that should bump us up even faster. Yes, yes, we're heading for bankruptcy. Sure, sure, sure. Uh, that's because we spent a bunch of money on education this month. But our bills are normally fine. Our stock's going down. 
Oh, we lost a... Oh. Because we buy some. Yeah, yeah. We're not interested currently. Um, it is August now. Was it not just... I'll have to check post, but... Um, I think it was July a second ago, so we may just skip the whole month with unused time. Since he was training. But it's worth it because now we're moving, obviously, 15% faster. Uh, collectively, 30% faster in the two uh, different things. 2D and uh, system. And just keep an eye out on the company here. Yeah, we're definitely not able to buy any more currently. Okay. Okay, so we're back here. Um, just now. A hair away from Design Iteration 4. Um, and we've sold some of our stocks to get us up to 60,000. Um, of course, some of our electronics are affected by the heat. Of course, of course. Uh, but they're still fine. And I think I would have been here a month earlier, but I accidentally let the uh, computer get below like 60%. Uh, I wasn't really thinking. I was just letting the time run. Um, but we should be able to build a new office now. So let's go into build mode, construct a wall. Here we go. And let's see. Three by five. And then a bathroom. Okay, let's go ahead and get a, a window, I guess. And let's get, of course, our office color set up. And then we'll just make this one the generic bathroom, uh, which is fun. And now we need to get some doors in, of course. Don't forget the doors. Put that one here. And just a door there. Okay. And let's go ahead and move over to Furnish. I'm going to select this. Copy it here. 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 Um, except we're going to replace all of these with our executive chair. Um, we, of course, have to get a clock. And uh, oops, gotta select. Hello. Hello. What? What the hell? I can't. I can't select the. Okay. We're gonna replace these with calculators. See, select entire building. Oops. This entire building. Oh. Oh, that is so annoying. We'll set this to calculator. Okay, we need a bookshelf, which is going to be awkwardly placed, sort of, right here. What in the world? Oh, we need to, I know, change this to half grid size. Um, there we go. Just had to offset the grid by a half. This should fit here. That's really weird that it does not.
I guess it does not necessarily matter exactly how it's done. Um, I, I guess I have to dismantle it. That's so weird. Um, anyway. AC unit directly above it. it is really strange that this does not fit here maybe I'll replace it with a hat a corner table and it'll fit hmm There we go. And then, of course, we need... We have a clock. We have a bookshelf. Need our mini fridge. For uh, the new employees we're about to hire. Should be good. Okay. That way they can eat. And then of course we need uh, bathroom thingies. Here we go. Think. And a toilet. And of course we need some lights. Oh, that looks weird. There we go. Perfect. Uh, even more perfect there. And the last thing we're going to do in this episode is actually hire the employees. Oops. So, uh, well, first thing we need to do, go ahead and move it into develop. And we are going to go into manage teams. And we're going to have a team of dedicated programmers. Okay. Um, and of course, they're going to work eight to four. We don't want them angry. They have lives or whatever. Something ridiculous like that. Uh, and we want them to be programmers. And for some reason, and we want them to have a secondary of service. To have them for system in 2D. And we want them for super focus. And we want medium salary. And I think we want... Oh, no. We did not get anyone with... Uh, modest, unfortunately. But three star and all that and some design is crazy. I thought I put medium. Did I not? I mean, this guy is really good. I think I'm going to hire him. And then we're going to wait until next month. Um, and check and see who we can hire. Really quick. Hopefully this episode isn't too long. I know I'm cutting out a bunch of footage. Uh, actually, I hope it's not too short. Uh, both of those are a worry. Um, but we want, oops, please change team to programmers. Okay. And then we want to go to hire and now we want it to be for programmers and begin looking. Okay. We did get a modest. Okay. Oh, and they're really good too. So that's two. Yes. I mean, that, that's really good. 
I, I can't not hire them. That's three. Okay, and we, we need one more. We will look next month. Oops. Uh, excuse me? What is going on? Oh, I forgot to assign them. Crap. Okay, we're good. Everything's fine. It, it just really sucks that I forgot to do the server, I think. I think that's really going to shut us down. But we'll have to see. Okay, and of course our company's in debt. Um, but that's okay. We want to hire... Oh, we can't hire technically because we don't have any money. Uh, we'll go to all companies. You, and we want to sell off... I don't know, 15 more shares. And we will go to hire employees again. Same same dealio. Again looking. Uh, unfortunately, no modest. That's fine. You get unlucky. Gotta roll with it. Gladys is pretty good. And this one's pretty good. Oh, that was Gladys and and Natalie. Uh, we have Fast Learner. Let's do Big Brain, I think. Okay. That should allow us to just pump this, this game out as quick as possible. Of course somebody called in sick. Why wouldn't they? Okay, so I have to... Please. It's like furniture type. Move furniture. There we go. And then we want to make sure our computer is still good. 86. 79 is pretty bad. Not that we're using it. All right. And we've got our team ready and our code going. And I think that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, go ahead and drop a like. If you want to see more, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Uh, new uploads every Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, unless I'm sick, of course, in which case it may be delayed. <laughs> and uh, leave a comment down below. Tell me what you think. Um, if you are mad that I look stuff up, if you are happy you can do it yourself now, or whatever. And the tutorial, uh, if you guys want it, ask in the comments. I'll link you to it. I don't know if I'll leave it in the description. Um, well, I'll probably leave it in the description. We'll see. Anyway, peace out.